Yo, what up? I'm way too excited for today's video. I finally got my hands on some Berea tacos, or at least the closest thing that I'll probably ever find here, to be honest with you. I've been wanting to try these ever since I first heard about them, which wasn't too long ago. It was probably about like a year ago or, or maybe a little bit more than that. They were super trendy, super popular, even viral with it. And um, I've, I looked, I was like, damn, you know, I, I can't find these. You know, I watched a bunch of YouTube videos and uh, they look so damn good. But I guess they're a little bit late to the party over here. But, you know, we even got the consomme, a little bit of, uh, I'll show you that here in a second. But I got three tacos right here. Large as well, large tacos, man. Real large. And this all came out to 20 bucks, so not too bad. Here is what the consomme is looking like. I'm not sure how authentic this is, to be honest with you. But like I said, I couldn't find any any kind of semblance of this um, before and now. So, you know, this is probably about as good as I'm going to get. Let me also try to show you the inside of one of these. Super cheesy and meaty. And they got the onions. Oh, my. Oh, my God, man. And the cilantro. This is, y'all. Look at that. That's thick. I'm gonna go in for a proper first bite. This might get messy, but into the consomme. I had to walk away for a second on that one. That is so crazy to me. This one has the cheese skirt, man. That, the flavor of that is, I can see why this went viral. I can see why it was all the rage. Here's a little in, look on the inside. Man, that is just the most delicious thing I've had in a minute. Let me try it without the, the sauce. I'm thinking what they do is cook this meat in this kind of stew sauce right here. And it's so tender. You know, pulled pork, this is like pulled, I want to say beef. I think originally uh, burrito tacos like this might be lamb, but there can be variations. They have two layers of tortillas here, which I think they're completely soaked in the sauce and then, you know, laid down on a flat top. And the texture is crazy. The flavor is crazy. Like this is just flavor town, man. A lot of cheese in here. The onions and the cilantro work perfectly. The meat, there's a good amount of it. A lot of it, I would say. Perfect texture. This has a little bit of lime in it which just gives it that extra kick of something that you might need. This crispy cheese, you put that on anything and it's gonna kick it up to the next level. Sheesh, man. Honestly, I was looking at the spot on the delivery app and I was like, I was very hesitant about it, very cautious, cautious. It did have very high ratings and really good reviews, but I was like, do they really know what's up with it? Can they really capture that flavor of at least the Mexican style food that I know and love? And I'll, they nailed it, this place. But like I'm saying, this is something like I've never even tasted before. I can't even 
begin to describe the flavors of it, to be honest with you. But you take any kind of stew, man, and you develop those flavors. You can get so rich with it, and you put some meat in that, and it just gets so tender and juicy and flavorful. And this is spicy, it's savory. Man. It's the ultimate indulgence. Um, and I've been looking forward to this for so long and it exceeded my expectations. So when something like that happens, like when you're actually looking forward to it, you have high expectations and then it just completely blows those expectations out the water. I did say that I really didn't uh, think a whole lot about this specific place, but this specific food, yeah, I was, I had high hopes and um, yeah. This is crazy, man. This is a real crazy. Mm. You hear that, y'all? But the inside, like, is soft. It's it's not like a hard shell taco shell. Somewhere in the middle, man. Jesus. I might be overacting a little bit. I could, I'll admit that, but. I'll tell you what, the sun's going down. I, I've got some crazy light right now. I have it a, an appointment, actually. I'm, I'm on the verge of being late to it. Uh, I gotta hurry up and eat this, but I don't want this to end, man. Like, I wanna savor this last one. One more little shot, like, sheesh, sheesh, man. Sheesh. Sorry guys, I had to eat that last one in silence. This is one of those things that if, there's a lot of foods I eat, like Western foods over here that, you know, if I had a, like a West, like a, one of my friends back from home in America come over, I wouldn't necessarily enter, like, hey, you gotta try this because to be fair, they could probably get it a better version back home. This right here though, this is one of those things that I would take them to it immediately. I don't see how you can get better than this, to be honest with you. Like, there's nothing that, like, and this is over the top almost to me. Like, there's so much cheese in that, so much meat, double wrapped shell. I'm just, God, I need like a cigar or something after that one, man. But yeah, about to skate out of here, man. Um, worth, it's definitely worth the hype. Definitely worth all the, the attention it was getting. Man, you gotta go try one of these. But yeah, I'll catch you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed this one. And I appreciate y'all for watching. Peace.